Gene Cell International, the continuation of life. Now that I have the joy of being a mother, the most important thing in my life is my baby's health and the well-being of my family. That's why when I found out through my doctor about the importance of collecting and storing the stem cells from the umbilical cord of my baby, I did not hesitate for a second to have the support of the service in order to preserve the health of my family in the future. Stem cells are generically defined as a master cell. What that means is that these cells have the ability to differentiate or mature into many different cell types of the body. This is extremely important in medicine because uh, stem cells can be used to treat various disorders where cells have either become injured or they die. Stem cells can be used to replace those injured or dead cells. When you decide to preserve your newborn baby's umbilical cord blood with Gene Cell International, you will secure the potential opportunity for your baby and your family to have access to a cell therapy product treating approximately 80 conditions, including several types of cancer, genetic diseases, blood disorder, and immune system deficiencies. The blood collection is a simple and painless procedure which does not interfere at all with the delivery or birthing process. There are more than 80 diseases that have been treated with stem cells from umbilical cord blood, like leukemia, lymphoma, myeloma, anemias, and others. However, this list continues to grow as long as research advances. Once our client has contracted the services, an umbilical cord blood kit is given to them. The client takes the kit to the hospital, the obstetrician collects the cord blood. Once the cord blood is collected, the bag is placed back into the box. The box is then packed up. Uh, the client will call Gene Cell Services, a client service department. Client services will assist the client in getting the cord blood back to our laboratory for processing and storage. Normally, after the baby is separated from the umbilical cord and the cord is clamped, the collection process begins. This needle is gently inserted into the thicker umbilical cord vein and the blood bag begins to fill with cord blood. The objective is to collect as much blood as possible to ensure a maximum amount of stem cells. Once the blood is finally collected, a label is placed in the front part of the collection bag. The label contains the mother and baby's name as well as the date and time of delivery. Once the process is finished, the cord blood sample is sent to our processing and cryogenic laboratory. Banking the umbilical cord blood stem cells of your newborn is a life-saving opportunity. For more information, visit our website www.genecell.com or call us to speak with one of our representatives.